passed away on Tuesday. He had a huge impact on the greater Lafayette area. You may remember him as the enthusiastic man who gave tours at the Celery Bog every Tuesday morning. Others will remember Sam as a great educator. News 18's Marvin Bills joins us live outside of the Lily Nature Center. Hey, Marvin. Jeff and Kayla, I'm standing outside where the celery bog is located. This right here is arguably one of Sam Postlewaite's favorite places to be. He left behind many photos and memories, but most importantly, an impact on Greater Lafayette as a whole. An educator, a teacher, and an icon. Sam Postlewaite passed away Tuesday, but he leaves behind so many memories and a greater impact. He was always so positive and he would always give me a hug and, and talk about this place and it, it was just great. Dan Dutton is the director of the Lily Nature Center, which houses the Celery Bog. This is where Sam would give tours every Tuesday, ready and eager to enlighten those who cross the paths of the Celery Bog and enter the world of Sam. Even after he retired, he's always teaching and he loves sharing information. Loves talking about how things interconnect the life of the nature to the life of people. Always making an effort to ensure everyone felt important. Sam never wanted anyone to feel alone. He rewarded all of his students. He he made a he made an effort to know in a class of 400, he made an effort to know their, them by name. With a drive and passion to learn more about the world we live in, Sam enjoyed capturing nature's beauty and sharing with everyone the authenticity of the world he loved so much. He took a gazillion pictures, and they're talking about thousands and thousands and thousands of pictures that he took, and what's going to happen to all those pictures? Some of them are on, uh, have, been, have been printed out and are in... Uh, in frames on the walls around here. With so many ways to describe a man who had only one mission, to love people and the world he lived in, Sam made it easy for people to remember just who he was. Awareness of other people, always. And I know this isn't a word you use to describe a man, but he, there was a sweetness about him. Sam Postlewood embraced anyone and everyone, and he will truly be missed every Tuesday morning, but he will never be forgotten. Our great grandchildren will remember Sam. I mean, I, I'm sort of trying to figure out what we're going to tell them. You know, yeah, when they, they say, come in, where's Sam? Mean, where is Sam? Yeah. Such an amazing story. Now, with those thousands and thousands and thousands of pictures that Sam captured, I want to share something with you all that I think is pretty amazing. So, I found out today that with all of those pictures Sam captured, he would create calendars each year. And every year, those calendars had a different theme. Well, this year the theme was birds. It's, it's truly an amazing, amazing man. And if you and if you had the chance to know him, it was a treat. If you want to see some of Sam. Sam's photos, I would encourage you to stop by the Celery Bog where you can see those thousands and thousands of pictures. Reporting live, Marvin Bills, News 18.